Good morning everyone, this is JB of Let's Go Long Pare and welcome to my YouTube channel, Dr. Tire Philippines. Now, today's topic is a very exciting one. This will be my tire damage assessment, the second video of the tire damage assessment that I will upload in my YouTube channel. Now, please understand that due to my limitations of movement and restrictions in NCR, I'd be utilizing some of the pictures that I have uh, <clears throat> in my file okay uh, some are actually from previous uh, inspections and some are from the car groups that people send me okay now <clears throat> today we're going to talk about run flat damage why is this happening or how it is happening and is it going to be covered by the manufacturers warranty okay now what is a run flat damage this damage is a result when you are uh, running your tire in a critically low air pressure based or referential to what was recommended by the vehicle manufacturer or tire manufacturer spec okay this can happen um, run flat damage can happen whether you are instant you are slow leaking or there there is a very slow leaking of air okay or instantaneous loss of air pressure okay so why are you losing air okay it could be for many reasons one you might have a penetrating cut or puncture or split okay on your tire whether on the tread or the sidewall second um, your tires might not be properly seated so air is leaking out from the bead zone or bead area third you might have uh, a damaged wheel so we're in cracks uh, might let air out okay fourth it will be your your valves okay your tire valves some tire valves are already aging or it's not conformed uh, or it, it's it loses its integrity as it ages uh, because they're made of some are made of rubbers and those metal ones would have rubber grommets that it loses um, or it lets out some of the air okay now <clears throat> let me tell you how it happens okay when you're running your tire at certain speed okay in a very critically or critically low air pressure your side will bends outward and the rim flange which is the edge of your wheel yeah that's right that's what you call uh, the edge of your wheel the rim flange is pressing the tire sidewall on the pavement that's why uh, the evolution of this damage you might see circumferential aggression on the sidewall some will be splits okay some will be uh, cuts because again yung yung sidewall na ang nakasayad sa lupa okay now note that um the the the, re the reason some of the tire uh, damage of the run flat damage is as as um, worse than it looks okay the others are not as worse this is because of the speed when this was happening or the speed of your vehicle when this was happening and also <clears throat> the rate of loss of air okay so um yung itsura kasi there are many evolutions of the damage I've seen thousands in the field okay yung iba kasi slow leak like I said slow leaking and the other one rapid air loss okay now let me tell you things about it that uh, really pisses me off some people um, whenever they ask me about this damage they are very particular about um, you know shaming the brand and they're going to talk about the age of the tire okay one it had nothing to do with the tire brand okay I've seen in the field uh, you about the best quality tires that you can get or money can buy uh, would experience the same damage okay even the worst tire that money can buy okay can experience the same damage same manifestation okay it had nothing to do with the tire brand number two um, it had nothing to do with the age of the tire. Please refrain from speaking about that alleged expiry of the tires. Whenever I see a post regarding a run flat damage, people would immediately talk about, "Hey, expired na kasi yung gulong mo. Ilang taon na ba yung gulong mo?" And I've seen some YouTube channel which made me piss and it creates panic and spreads fake news. Oh, ito 
Kaya ganito yung tire damage na to Kaya yung run flat damage Ganito yung tsura Kasi expired na Ito tingnan mo Hindi ganito Hindi masyadong sabog Okay That was one of the worst uh, Tire assessment that I've seen In YouTube channel And I wish YouTube would take that down Because it creates panic And he's spreading wrong information um, <clears throat> Uulitin ko lang Kaya yung iba Worse yung itsura Because of Yung bilis ng pagkawala ng hangin at bilis ng speed ng vehicle while that was happening that damage was happening okay yung iba naman hindi masyadong worse kasi mabagal okay mabagal so please please um, I wish I could speak to that guy and reach out to that guy and and, and train him um, uh, he, he's working for a tire dealer shop and he's saying inaccurate things about the tires that um, you know gives people panic I don't know if its intention is to sell more but in in in, in, in that in that case um, he, he's he's tricking he's, he's actually trying to give people false information okay so anyway moving forward um, it also this happens as well for those people who do not maintain air pressure um, I've been talking about this many times in in a lot of my videos in in, in tech talk that um, not tech talk tech talk uh, technical talk uh, tires would lose air pressure even if you don't have any tire damage uh, or tire injuries okay for the reasons of permeability some air molecules would be let out by the inner liner and if you're the type of person who does not check your tire pressure regularly yung 1 psi ngayon could be 2 psi next month 3 psi and 10 psi and some consumers would say nangyari lang sa akin to james na nag highway ako eh bigla siyang sumabog now but <clears throat> understand that you might be running on a critically low air pressure already however you're running on traffic that's why um, hindi pa siya na demount or the sidewall can still withstand um, what is left or can still work on what pressure is left now when you started um, running on a higher speed where in the sidewall will flex or would have if uh, a flexing a very high frequency flexing dun na dun na nagre result yung run flat damage okay now um the very critical question that I would answer is is this covered by the warranty unfortunately not run flat damages are not covered by the manufacturers warranty however there are some manufacturers would cover the road with their uh, would cover this because of their road hazard warranty not all but some okay now I hope you guys learned from this video and um, uh, if you want to know more about some uh, technicals about the tires and tire safety tips, you can like and subscribe to my YouTube channel, Dr. Tire Philippines. And also, we do have a Facebook page called Let's Gulong Pare Kaalaman Tungkol Sa Gulong by Dr. Tire Page. Now, I'll see you again next time. Bye!